What's going on everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. All right guys, we're going to go back to a photo I have done just recently. Uh, we're talking about, what, seven, eight days ago? We're going to check this out, but this time in some better detail. And I think you guys will definitely agree that whatever this thing is, it's definitely not a mountain or some kind of butte, right? Let me show you the video I'm talking about. And a lot of you guys weighed in on this, which was awesome. Vessel-like anomaly found on Mars. And of course, we went back to April 30th, which is only, what, maybe eight days ago, whatever it was. Either way, I mean, you can see this object right here. And here's the photo that was used. And you can see right here, it's way up in the background. And if I zoom in, it's 500%. Now, I showed you these little objects here. They look like, they, to me, they look like almost like a bookend. They're almost identical, right? Pretty darn close. But the object in question was right here. Now, what I find amazing about this thing is, like I said, I saw this rounded off here. And, of course, went into this crap here. And I was able to pull out some of these details inside this. Well, there's a different photo. This one here, you can see right here at the top. It's Sol 2365. And, of course, this was from, and you can see right here, NCAM right there. NCAM. So, that's a nav cam. Now, the newer one, and when I say newer, I mean uh, because it's a lot newer photo. This one here is 2393. Now, this time, you can see the antenna on the Curiosity is right here, uh, right here in this, this can type thing. And the anomaly is now to the right of the rover, and it seems to be a little bit better quality photo. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So let's zoom into this, and I'm going to show you guys a little bit of detail. But let me do this too. Let me just backtrack just a hair bit. Notice how much detail is in here, right? You can see some pretty decent details. There's some that I did not see. Why? This photo is not as good as the other. All right. So let's get back into this one here. Now, let's try to go in as far as we can. This is 500%. That's the furthest we can go into the photo. Check out now. You can see more detail. And this is cool. First, you've got this right here where they try to smooth this over to make it look like a mountain or a butte right but you can see right here where it actually drops down goes straight across it looks like this thing actually goes straight and they took apart this corner giving this rounded look i think it actually comes out see the way it's straight i think it actually comes out straight like this but look at this it continues on down here wait a minute wait a minute how the hell how are we see in the corner of this thing in the dirt it's supposed to be dunes over here or something see that it's not and you're going to see this a little bit better in a moment actually a lot better uh, after enhancing this, there's another thing I didn't see last time. Right here, there's this, it looks like this bar or something goes up, goes across, comes back down, goes like this here and goes back down. And I'm going to show you why that's pretty cool and why it, it may actually be part of this item. Check over here on the, on the left hand side, look at the way this thing comes up. It comes up like this, got a corner, goes across, another smooth corner and then drops. Wait a minute, is this a pile of dirt or not? And this is what I'm saying. A lot of these things are trying to dress up as mountains and buttes. I want you to take note of something, guys. You can get out your magnifier before I do this. But it appears to be a structure in here. And it's very, very faint. But it's right here. Look where I'm circling here with the cursor. It looks like a white building with a bunch of, what, a bunch of uh, what look like windows or some kind of dots. Check this out. Look in the background right here. Right here. A little bit of white right there. And you can see these right here. In the background, a little bit of white right here. You got these straight pieces. See this right here? This is cool. This is what I'm saying. You can actually see the items, but you can also see the manipulation they throw over them, right? Look at these nice straight lines just under little black lines. Again, slide over to here and see all this mush and this crap. Right here, you can see very faintly there's actually a corner to this white piece right here. Actually goes up, goes over. In fact, I'm going to look at it right now with my eyepiece. And I can see what looks like this white object. You can see where they try to cover this up. They went like this here, one over like this. But inside right here, it looks like it stops. Right here, it goes across. Down here, you see a little bit more white right here. It looks like these, either they're mockings or they're windows of some sort, right? And I'm looking at it right now, and that's exactly what it appears to be. Is it actually a structure? I don't know. I can't vet that. But here's another thing you want to do. Just back up just a little bit and start to look at the other whiter pieces in here because I'm going to tell you what, right here... You can see something right here. It goes like this, stops, goes across, drops back down. See that? Literally drops down. But what you want to do, so the photo doesn't break up, use your magnifier now and look at these whited areas. Not the darker areas they try to put over it. These are structures. Now, either the pots of structures are smaller pieces, because if you say, well, if that's some kind of vessel or craft, how big are these structures? That doesn't make much sense. 
well, we don't know what this thing is. This could be some large, one of their their ideas of a, a cruise ship or some kind of weird craft, right? Or it's a spacecraft of some sort or a structure overturned. We don't know. All I know is by looking at this, I can tell that this is definitely not natural. Now, let me go into Photoshop because I want to show you this a lot bigger and clearer. Let's jump into that. All right, this is the way the photo came. We blew it up a little bit for you guys. Now, let's really zoom into this because this is cool. All right, now check this thing out. I can see this so much better. I put a little blur into it so we can, we don't have it too breaking up too badly. And again, we've got this object right here on the left. We can do this. We've got this object that comes up like this, goes across like this, nice and rounded, back down. Then we've got this pile of garbage, whatever that is, right? Check this thing out. we got what looks like some kind of straight piece right here. Comes up to the front. And what looks like it kind of has this archway. See that? And then you've got this other objects in the back. Right here. And you can see where they try to hide it. I don't know if these are actual mountains near it. And you can see right here. It looks like a bunch of windows. You can see a little white right here. And then the white faded out right here. The best thing to do is get the actual photo. Meaning the raw photo. Because sometimes you, gotta, you guys got to understand. First of all, we got kind of a uh, low-res photo to begin with, right? So now I take it, put it in Photoshop. Even if I don't do a darn thing to it, it doesn't matter. Uploading it to YouTube, doesn't matter how good you try to do it, HD or whatever. Sometimes you, well, it's not sometimes, you actually do lose quality. So get the raw photo, which you guys know, you'll get the link to it, right? And guys, just look into this stuff. It's just, it's really crazy. Here's another thing. Goes up like this, goes up like this. You can actually see this goes down like this. What's really wild about it is you got the edge, it looks like it's flat here, and then it goes down on the side here, and you got this edge. Why do you still see the edge inside what looks like dirt covering it? See this? What is that? That's supposed to be dirt covering, but yet you can still see the actual shop corner to this thing. How is that possible? Or it's very lightly covering it over, right? Now, this is what I was talking about right here, and you can see that this object going like this, it looks like it's got some kind of weird thing. I don't know if you guys can see this dark and goes down like this. Okay, goes over and it continues to go straight. This crap here going like this, I believe that's a manipulation. I believe that they did that just trying to round this thing off to make it look like some kind of weird mountain, right? And yet you can see it coming down, goes across like this here. And I think again, they cut this thing off to make it rounded here and erase everything else that's above this. I think this skyline's crap. I think there's actually a lot bigger things sitting over here, and it's just we just cannot see it because they're keeping everything uh, out of sight by doing this manipulation. Now, check this out. This object does, in fact, go like this, go like this, and goes like that. How is it possible that this, if this is actually dunes or dirt, whatever it may be, how are we seeing the other side of that or the corner to that right there? How does that make sense to anybody? Let's bring up the exposure a little bit so you guys can see this a little bit better. See that? How is that possible, guys? Is it possible that something has fallen on this object? I don't think it is. I think it's manipulation. I think they just try to go over it. Here's another thing I want you guys to take note of. Look at this right here. There's something. Here's the corner of that. And then you've got this object that goes like this here. Comes down. And it's straight across. And it looks like it does this. It looks like it has this weird piece. And then, of course, you don't see any of that. You just kind of see that's it. Right? What could that be? What kind of drew me to this again was that it looked like some kind of weird frame structure right here. Something right there. And it, this is going down. I don't know if you guys can see this, but there it is, right? Goes across. Goes across. Now, here's another thing that's pretty cool. Watch this. Goes up. Goes over. Nice smooth corner. Comes around. Goes like this here. Here's the wild pot. I want you guys to take note of the size of this thing. Now, look at the distance between from this bar to this edge and the same thing on this side. This is where this one goes down, goes up like this. We're going to make the assumption, and I hate to do that, but we're going to go like this. That's the side. Look at the side. does the same thing. It's almost the same distance. Now, if you just picture this thing being cocked on its side, this is going to vary a little bit from this bar to this edge and so forth onto this one. Now, let's go ahead and enhance this thing a little bit better. And I just brought that like this. You can see the, the line going like this. Okay. So let's bring that out. Okay. Let's keep going. 
Now, I darkened all the lines that are in there to give you guys a better idea what I'm seeing here, right? Now, what I try to do is bring out the best I could right here. This bar we just looked at. The outer edge of this thing. But check this out. We got what looks like a round hole here. And you can tell it's on a slant because... Let's go back to this right here. That's exactly what you expect to see something that's cocked like that. You'll see the side of the inner hole... It's, you can actually see the whole wall of it, and you'll see nothing on this side of the hole, right? So, I'm going to go ahead and put a dock again, because I want to show you that right there. There's another one looks like it's like right here, like almost like a barrel type thing, going like this. Maybe it's something that propels this thing and just whoosh, and comes out, you know what I mean? Who knows? I'm just guessing, of course, and it's pure speculation, but what I find weird about things is check that thing out. Whatever that is... And I'm just going to go ahead and just brighten this up for you guys. Just go ahead and bring up the exposure. Now, I find this a little odd that this thing is like this. Check that out. To me, it's either some kind of vessel, a craft, some kind of craft, whether it hovers, flies, whatever the hell it does. And then, of course, it could be a structure, right? I don't know. You guys tell me, what the hell is that? And why is it right there on Mars? And again, we can go over to this area here. And, of course, I brought it way up so you can barely see this right there right here this white pot and then right over here another white pot of it and you can see what looks like all these little black specks well not there going across right directly onto each other see that and again now you can see this better right here and right here and like I said guys I mean just look at this thing right here it's got this like I said it goes like this completely straight it has like what looks like a weird um arch to it now again this is right here this is the raw photo and i put rgb raw because i want to put it in color so you can see the red arrow uh some of you guys suggested doing a different color arrow so i might uh, consider that um i know some of you guys said that uh, well i think one of you guys said you were colorblind it's hard to see that and i understand uh, we could probably change it to a green it would probably help and we got this and we've got this object like i said right here which has got these white and has all these bunch of little dots in it now, what the hell that is, of course, I'm not doing it directly on top. And you can see a little bit of the white right there. And, of course, we get this other um, object. Tell me what you guys think this is, man. Just a reminder, guys, we're going to have uh, a live, if everything goes right, because my I'm trying to get the, the recording software to work with the streaming of YouTube. It's the first time I'm doing it. So if it does fail, we won't be live. Um, and I'll end up putting another video. I'll put a video of uh, my guest as well as myself, of course. Uh, we'll make a video of it. Either way, uh, we'll get it out to you guys. Uh, so just a reminder, Wednesday, 6 p.m. Eastern time instead of 7. Um, that's only on Sundays. We're going to do 7 p.m. Um, but uh, Wednesday, we're going to do it a little bit earlier. We're going to do it at 6 p.m. So join us for that. All right, guys. Tell me what you think that is. Here we are right here. And there you are. Guys, it just screams intelligently made. It doesn't look like anything like a butte, a mountain, or any of that sort. It looks like they're trying to make it into one, right? Anyway, as always, you guys be the judge. Let me know what you think. Drop a comment, your thoughts down below. Like, and please share the video. You guys are what makes all the difference in this channel, whether it, you know, it goes down, it stays up. You guys call the shots, right? Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow, 6 p.m. Wednesday, Eastern Time. With that, you guys have yourself a good night, and we'll see you on the flip side.